You boys are crazy this morning. You boys <laughs> you crazy this morning. Are you guys happy the sun's shining? Is the sun shining so it's making you guys all happy this morning? Hmm? You too, Merlin? Yes? <laughs> Trying to make my breakfast and I just hear rustling and barking, Milo howling. <laughs> I had to come see what was going on. And of course a squirrel came. Yes. Of course. Oh, he got by, he got past my little uh thing that he's supposed to get that's supposed to stop him. That little circle thing there. Oh well, I guess he needs to eat too. He needs to eat too, Magnum. He wants to eat breakfast too. Yes. Alright, let's get back to making my breakfast. All right, what's for breakfast today? Today is corned beef, hash, and eggs. Excuse my washing machine. You probably heard it earlier, too. Um, getting some stuff washed today. Um, my husband says I can't make corned beef hash when he's home because he can't see sm the smell of corned beef hash. My daughter and I love corned beef hash. What's going on over there? I think they're behind the couch playing. Oh, they're chasing kitty. <laughs> they're chasing the kitty still. Oh my goodness. They've been chasing them all morning. Then they stop, they wrestle, they play together, and then they chase the kitty some more. <laughs> you guys think you need some breakfast of mine too? I don't know. I'm kind of hungry today. I don't know if there'll be any uh, leftovers for you. I'm not sure. No, I'm kind of hungry today. I went out and... Uh, let the boys out and then I let them in and then I stayed out and shoveled some paths. Can you guys see them? There's one right here, one over here, and then over that away I made a big circle. Um, so I'm hungry. Yes, I am. I'm hungry today. Yes, I don't think I'm sharing today. No, no, I don't think so. <laughs> All right, let me eat my breakfast. Are you boys getting some vitamin D from the sun today? Marley, you got to get in a sunspot. You got to get yourself in a sunspot to get your vitamin D. Yes. <laughs> Look, it's just like Mozzie, see? He's laying right in the sun getting his vitamin D, Marley. Yes. Looks like Max is toasting his buns in his head. <laughs> Even Kitten, can you see? See Kitten over there? He's over there sleeping in a sunspot. Yep. Everybody's getting some sun today. It's really pretty out today. It's cold out, but the sun makes it look really pretty out. Yes. So I've got my last load of laundry going in my dryer over here. And I cleaned up my kitchen. Got my dishes all done, got my sink empty. So I think I'm gonna grab some doggy shampoo and towels and clean up your guys' faces. Yes, because they're pretty crusty. Yes. You know when their beards get like really uh, hard and stuff just because they're just, they're too dirty. It's, you might as well not even brush them now. You might as well just wash their faces. Yes. Might as well just wash your faces. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, see Grant's there. Cause he gets a little bit of wet food in his. I'd be giving the other boys a little bit of wet food too, honestly. <laughs> so when they get that little bit of wet food on their beard, after four or five days, brushing it just ain't cutting it anymore. They just need to be washed. Yes, Marley just need those faces washed. So I think that's what I'm gonna do now. I may take them outside first. Get them outside, get them, get all their business done and then wash their faces. So let me get on my coat and boots. I'll make you guys some more pass, okay? All right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> hey, hey, okay, I made you boys pass. 
I made you some I made you some pass. So let's see if you even notice or if you go down on them. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to tell you guys, there's a possum living under our shed. Magnum and Milo were outside the other night, and they were barking crazy. Um, thankfully, at the back of the shed, we have some fencing so the boys can't get behind there. Um, and they were just barking like mad. They wouldn't come in. So I got my husband. I got the camera zoomed in. <laughs> um, oh, they're in the path. They're going down the path, checking it out. <laughs> um, so he went back there and yeah, he saw it. it was behind a piece of wood back there and then it zipped under the shed. So we're gonna have to get somebody to come put a trap out maybe. I don't know. I don't know what you do, how you get them out from under there, but um, yeah, so there's a possum living back there. I don't know why animals want to live in this backyard with seven schnauzers. But look what he brought me. Okay, I'm going to kick it. I'm going to kick it. <laughs> it's going to get snowy. He don't like snow in his mouth. <laughs> All right, Grant didn't come out, so I've got to go in and find him. Grant! Oh, you getting a drink of water? Come on. You need to come outside real quick. And get your business taken care of. Come on. Let's go. Come on. All right, I'm going to shovel some more paths for the boys. And uh, get their faces washed. All right, the lighting isn't very good because the sun is shining so bright, but <laughs> a lot of you were asking me how I got the boys to uh, sit and wait for their beards to get brushed in my video, um, the video I did, Typical Morning, our Typical Morning or something like that I titled it. Um, so over in this drawer next to my chair, I usually, I have this brush in it, this slicker brush, and I have cookies. <laughs> yes, I keep treats in there. And the boys know that if they sit, um, they always come out here after I wash their faces and wait to get their beards brushed. Um, but they know when I sit here and I open this drawer up, all I got to do is open it. They know to come uh, sit around the chair and wait and get their beard brushed and they're going to get a cookie. So that's how I get them to do it. Yes. What are you doing to Marley? You sniffing his face? So I need to give them their treat. And right now in the um, uh, drawer, I have these steak snacks by American Kennel Club. They're not too bad. And then I have a box of little mini uh, milk bones I'm using up uh, too that I give them. Yeah, the lighting is terrible. Hopefully you guys can even see what's going on. On my phone, there's, um, if I can get this bag open, hold on. I'll use my mouth. <laughs> All right. And you got to watch out when you're passing out treats to these boys. Because they'll get done eating it. And then come back up here like they didn't get one. Like Magnum here. <laughs> and then I almost give them another. Did I give you one? I don't remember. Oh, I started talking and now I don't know. I'm going to have to watch this back and see if I gave Mozzie two. <laughs> I also have some kitty treats. If you can see Merlin, he's waiting patiently for a kitty treat. So let me, let me put these back and get the kitty treats. Yep, got kitty treats in there too. Some of these temptations. I need to get, um, I need to go buy some more kitty treats, these little bags. This one's getting a little low. All right, kitty, I'm gonna throw it. Now you're gonna have to get it before the boys get it. Oh. <laughs> Get the kitten on. Throw it to him. All right, I know kitten's over here, probably in his bed. Yep. There you go, kitty. I'll give you two. I'll give. Oh, we'll give Merlin another one. You ready for another one, Merlin? You ready for another one? All right, so yeah, that's how I get them to uh, come out here and let me brush their beards. 
All right, guys, I'm going to get going. My morning has pretty much been um, taken up with feeding boys, giving boys medicine, taking them outside, shoveling past. You just, <laughs> Milo, you're going to kiss my makeup off. <laughs> um, cleaning them up, cleaning myself up. And now I've got to get on with the rest of my day and uh, my errands. So hope everyone's having a great day. We'll talk to you guys again soon. Bye-bye.